Savannah City Council approved the 2021 budget with a focus on eradication of poverty, violent crimes, and blight. Several other priorities are also part of this council's focus. Behavioral health unit has been something we've been working on for, for several years and uh, came out of a grant, um, Justice Department grant, that uh, allowed us to uh, bring on two full-time officers that would be dedicated to um, the behavioral health unit and also a, a clinician. If an officer on scene is experiencing something they need more assistance with, they can call us for uh, resources and to kind of help get the situation steered into the right track. The officers are able to intercept people that are, that are uh, a lot of times having police contact or EMS contact, and they're able to um, find those services that they're needing at those moments in time and, and to get them into those services uh, instead of sending them to jail. So when an officer kind of runs into a, a dead end with a situation, um, they can contact us for, for assistance to get the person into resources and potentially free that officer up to be able to respond to more serious or time-pressing calls. So having our officers out there um, and being able to communicate with them directly, uh, being able to call um, the doctors at the hospital, the clinician um, being able to um, make determinations right on the scene, right on the street, um, stops a lot of the issues that an officer would run into without having any of those um, services available. And, uh, and it's getting people the right help. It's getting people um, the help and it's also helping their families. City Council seems to be on board with, uh, with what's going on and to approve um, kind of uh, supporting this program for the 2021 budget and helping help finance the program. So I think it's being received very well. Um, officers tend to uh, receive us very well and appreciate the assistance. Um, I know their supervisors appreciate it when we can relieve those officers and send them back to the street to, uh, to handle calls. You know, to me they're all successes and, and, and you know, in the hopes that we'll continue to expand this unit and, and push it forward into the future. Mental health and substance abuse are kind of the catalyst to a lot of the misdemeanor crimes that are occurring throughout the city and the reoccurring crimes. So if we can get that individual into, into, into services and kind of catch the issue before it becomes a problem, um, then hopefully long term it'll, it'll show crime decreasing. For more information and a detailed description of the six policy priority areas, visit savannahga.gov budget.